with the brushing off with cedar boughs, Esquayo Air received a traditional blessing ceremony from the Musqueam Nation. It was really important for us to start the business in a good way. And what that means is to ask permission of the Musqueam people to operate, to conduct business on their sacred unceded territory. Tira Fraser is the CEO and says she's proud to be the first indigenous woman to have her own airline. She's made tea, born in Hay River, Northwest Territories, and eventually she moved to the Laura mainland when she was 19. She says her life changed in 2001 when she took a flight to Africa in a small plane. She became very inspired. Soon after, she got her commercial pilot's license and started an aerial survey company called Kesick Aerial Survey, which she sold in 2016. I wanted to do this because uh, I have expertise in aviation. I'm from small remote communities and understand the importance of connecting into uh, small communities. I am passionate and inspired about Indigenous tourism and uh, I have a passion for leadership and I'd like to bring uh, an airline to the industry that uh, does things differently. And today it's all about celebrating that vision. Friends, family and colleagues are here to support her and offer their congratulations. I'm so proud of her as an Indigenous woman, uh, as an Indigenous, as a, as a pilot, as a woman who is a pilot, an Indigenous woman who is a pilot, who now, she bought a plane and <laughs> she started her own airline. It makes me very, very happy, you know, I, to, for her to, to be doing this. Very happy. And with a strong sense of culture and respect for tradition, Tira Fraser hopes this airline will grow into something very special. The word Esquayo is a Cree word meaning woman, and this Piper Navajo chieftain is an eight-seat aircraft that will start flying in March of 2019. The company will be announcing their routes in the next few months. Tina House, APTN National News, Richmond.